All right, I'm gonna full focus on the game here. I just want to play for priority. I see my jungle is pathing into top. I see that enemy jungle is most likely also pathing into top. Both jungles pathing into top. I think we can win the 2v2 in the early game, so that's very nice. All right, enemy jungle should path into top, so I'm gonna leave my ward right here and allow this wave to bounce into me. And the reason I let this bounce into me is so that I'm not forced to walk up for last hits, and that makes it so that I'm never gankable here, right? Okay, there you go. We saw the Diana, 24 CS. That's the first thing I check as well. It means she's done every single camp. You see, I'm not gankable because I'm letting this wave bounce back into me, guys. This is why the early game tracking is so important. I need one minute of EXP to get my level four. I'm gonna grab this quickly and help my jungle out. There we go, I'm coming, bro. That's an interesting flash. See guys, jungle tracking is so imperative. I play my waves not around my lane opponent 1v1. I play my waves around enemy jungle. And when you learn how to do this, the game will become so much easier for you to play in general. Because you're never gankable. 